Hey guys, for this first raid, we've got a base build I haven't seen happen in a while. It's actually an armored base built on top of a rock, so we're gonna have to ladder up to get there, but it looks like it should be a pretty quick or cheap raid. Only a few walls we should have to go through here. They actually left their ladder hatch open up there. Maybe we can climb on that and take that door out? All right, here we go. This is a sheet metal door. One C4 will do it. Would send a rocket here, but I kinda wanna leave this hatch up. Ooh, okay, it's zigzagging around already. Let's go for this garage door. Come on, workbench three, boxes, and some more garage doors. Here's the armored portion of the base. I imagine there's gotta be some loop below me. If we can just find a cheap way to get down. After following that path all around, this has gotta be the hatch or we should be close. Alright, finally, we are possibly going down. Here we go. That was way more expensive than it should have been. Probably could have just taken an armored wall here in the first floor, but we're finally in. There should be a TC around here. There we go. I do have a counter coming in. TC's below overlap me, so we can't seal this off. Let's see what they have. We got food. Hazmat suits, weapons. Some explosive ammo in there. Over 1,500 explosive ammo in this next box. More gear sets, two LRs, and another freaking counter. Alright, let's check what was in that TC. Let's see, for TC, there's really not much sulfur. I want scraps. Give me scraps. We need to start defending this thing from this clown. I believe we saw most of the loot in here already, just trying to defend it. And we'll go back there and grab the rest of the components. Probably gonna take you guys to the next raid now. If they try coming in here, I'll throw it in the video. We've got yet another rock base. I've been all over this thing and I found one huge mistake this dude made. Come check this out. And look in this reinforced glass window. You can see the TC through the window. Let's see if it'll profit. It's gonna be pretty tough not to. Well, the hard part's gonna be jumping in here. There we go. So we got TC, workbench three coffins, just with two C4. And we can place our own window bars back up there. Counter Raider's already coming in hot, kind of funny. Here we go, explosive ammo. Oh my God, is he already on the base? Bunch of explosive ammo. 
20 explosives, 6k soul for ore. Here we go, 52 more explosives. Loot just keeps on coming. Even the furnaces are loaded, guys. Almost 11,000 sulfur, so that definitely paid off. Let's see what else he had up here. More furnaces, can we get sulfur? Okay, those are empty. And this base is just completely not secure at all, like missing doors and hatches. And up here, just a few more gear items. 3K metal. Well, not the most interesting of bases, but hey, we profited. That's all we're going for. Kind of hilarious that he left the TC right in the wide open where you could see it. And I actually forgot to check the TC. Let's see what he had in there. Another 16K sold for 4K GP. Let's go, boys. We take those. All right, this next base kind of out in the middle of a lake. We're going to have to take cover somehow from counter raiders. We know it's not decaying. He's still got some twig left up on it. Some roof placement going on in there too. Wonder what's happened over here. There's a door left open. Okay, some sort of maybe starter base. Heli is coming in. Let's go ahead and check this base out. Kind of want to start raiding this thing before that heli gets here. So let's take this sheet door. What the heck? So it is going to be a roof stack to base, but we might be able to get up there? What's up with people leaving hatches unlocked? That's pretty nice. And we found another sheet metal door up here, so I think we might have just skipped some of that roof stacking. Oh, here's the roof stacking, all armor. This is nice. It's kind of like a TP. Um, I guess we're gonna have to drill through it. It's gonna be a pain in the butt, but let's go for it. Um, wow, we're still not into the loot. This thing was way more secure than I thought. We have just enough to take one of these sheet metal ceilings here. Oh, what the heck? My dude's standing in here AFK. That was unexpected. Let's see, I hear some vending machines. Coffin's got some bean cans. Might actually have to use those if we run out of stuff here. There's a sheet metal door that could be a TC. No sulfur in the furnaces. Let's take this door. All right, nothing in there. So there's only one half of the base that's sealed off, which is over on this side. I assume that's where TC's gonna be. Maybe this stone wall we can take out and it'll lead us to it. I'm trying to stay quiet in here, guys. I want to come back here with some more rockets and C4. Just shooting off all of this explosive ammo is going to be a pain and we'll definitely have some people come in. All right, guys, we're back here with a bit more stuff. Who would have thought this base was going to be that secure? But I'm hoping this dude's got some sulfur stash in here. Let's take out this stone wall. Okay, a workbench. And we've got armored doors. Don't think those are going to the outside. Didn't see any door path that's armored. Here we go, guys. Vending machines. Really only one spot the loot could have been. Where's the TC, though? Still not seeing it? Oh my god, I think these were just being used to block people from coming in the roof. So we still need to find TC. But checking out these walls, guys, they're sealed off over here, left open all around on the other side. My guess is there could be some stuff sealed off. We've got just enough rockets and C4 to finish, I want to say, two of these walls off. Already kind of damaged from the rockets. This 
Still nothing. All right, that's TC. Didn't even see it there for a second. We do have a counter right on us. Let's see what was in here. Oh my God, guys. No sulfur and we used like 15 freaking C4 on this thing at least. So that's just an incredible base build for such a small base. I just want to try to get out of here alive. Don't think they know about the hatch I came in. Um, yeah, that's pretty much gonna be it for today's video. I mean, we scored on one of the raids, but people are just learning how to build some nice secure bases. I'm liking this design. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully we can get a bit more lucky with some raids and maybe even try a bigger clan base.